Hi everyone, this is Mrs. Clark here, your librarian. There are three books I'm going to tell you about that are available for checkout in the library today. The first book is called On the Come Up. 16-year-old Brie wants to be one of the greatest rappers of all time, or at least win her first battle. As the daughter of an underground hip-hop legend who died right before he hit big, Brie's got massive shoes to fill. But it's hard to get your come up when you're labeled a hoodlum at your school, and your fridge at home is empty after your mom loses her job. So Brie pours her anger and frustration into her first song, which goes viral, for all the wrong reasons. Brie soon finds herself at the center of a controversy in the media. But with an eviction notice staring her family down, Brie doesn't just want to make it, she has to even if it means becoming the very thing the public has made her out to be. Written by the same author as The Hate You Give, this is one story full of heart, full of hip-hop, and full of fighting for your dreams. You aren't going to want to miss it. The next book is called Windfall. Alice has never believed in luck, but that doesn't stop her from rooting for love. After pining for her best friend Teddy for years, she jokingly gives him a lottery ticket on his birthday, attached to a note professing her love. Then, the unthinkable happens. He actually wins. At first, it seems like the luckiest thing on earth. But as Teddy gets swept up by his $140 million windfall, fame and fortune come between them. Alice is forced to consider whether her stroke of good fortune might have been anything but. She bought a winning lottery ticket, he collected the cash. Will they realize that true love's the real prize? This is a wonderful story of hope, chance, and change. Perfect if you're looking for a little romance read for this February. The last book I'm going to tell you about is called Dry. The drought, or the tap out as everyone calls it, has been going on for a while now. Everyone's lives have become an endless list of don'ts. Don't water the lawn. Don't fill up your pool. Don't take long showers until the taps run dry. Suddenly, Alyssa's quiet suburban street in California spirals into a war zone of desperation. Neighbors and families turn against each other on the hunt for water. And when her parents don't return and her life and the life of her brother are threatened, Alyssa has to make impossible choices if she's going to survive. No one does doom like this author, so if you're looking for one intense edge of your seat read, do not miss out on this one. If you're interested in any of these books, they'll be available for checkout at the circulation desk when you visit the library today. Be sure to snag a copy and have a great day!